Welcome back guys to another set of Darkness 2. Um, first of all, sorry for the long time it's taken me to upload some more of this. I know I actually forgot to upload the last part. I thought I actually already uploaded it, so that's why you, I put up like some sort of an old video um, right before this. But um, uh, yeah, I feel like saying this every single time I'm starting to record. But yeah, I've been sick again. Um, I've, ha I've had a cold, so yeah. Um, being sick is kind of the worst nightmare for a commentator, so... Yeah, there's not really much I can do, but my voice is back. I'm still kind of kind of having a small cold, so uh, yeah, I don't know. Sometimes I might sneeze, cough or something, I don't know. But I'm really sorry about that if that happens, but I'm trying my best to keep it down. That's also why I have some coke. But enough of that talking jibbity jabbity. Now it's time to continue the darkness too. And um, I actually finally got so, uh, fraps to work with this game with the so good, huh? um, before I was oh, using shit. Bandicam, so. I'm glad you're all right, Vin. Now, can you tell me what the fuck just happened? I don't know. I saw some weird-looking guy had a limp. It was crazy. Like, one minute he's there, the next minute the guy just fucking disappears. I don't know. I must have hit my head or something. Look, anyways, Jimmy says he's got a lead on the crew that hit us. Good. I'll find Jimmy. Tell him to meet me in my office. I'm gonna head upstairs. Yeah, sure. Whatever you need, Jackie. All right. Go to Jackie's bedroom upstairs. Okay, so we apparently live in, like, some huge... Uh, house. I don't even know if you can see that, but right now, Dragon can see just went online, or you just start playing Team Fortress 2. It's probably, wait, maybe I should tr quickly set myself an offline. How do you do that? I think it's all friends, and they go, oh, there we go. Offline, there we go. Look at that, now look at that. Okay. Uh, I have no idea where my room is. <laughs> this is probably my room. No, oh. It's a toilet. <laughs> Great. This is my room. No, I don't want to listen to that shit. Okay, so we got another bathroom here. Well, it kind of looked at it like this, man. Turn on tap. Nice. Can we take a shower or something? Oh, oh, we can't even jump out that one. Oh, damn. That sucks. I right, turn off that. I want to use to. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. Wasting a lot of water here. <laughs> Alright, um, I think it's not here, I think it's over here instead. It seems like ha I can run, I think. Thank Christ you got it back, you know. What do you mean? Leo you and Butcher Joyce. And you get the horns? What up? <laughs> well, hmm. mess with Jackie and you get those two things of his. I'll take those things over horns any day. I'm hey, Butch, Leo. Hey, boss, we was just talking about you. Glad you got your uh, mojo back. Let's send a message to these fucks that think they can hit us. Hey, you got that right. We're ready whenever you need us, boss. Hmm. All right. All right. Well, hey, I'll just go to my. Oh, this is my <laughs> high horse head. Hold uh, that bed or something. Light a candle. Oh, it's for my girlfriend. Okay. I saw you again today, in the alley, down on the tracks. I still see you, everywhere I go. Hmm. She's got a piercing. You torture yourself with her memory, Jackie. Oh, who are you? Aunt Sarah, what up? What she is it? You would never have wanted this. It scares me that you're so much like your father, Carlo. He could never let things go. Aunt Sarah, I'm fine. How many times I gotta tell you? You're a terrible liar, Jackie. Sometimes, sometimes I, I think I see her. And it's like, it's like she's not gone. But she is gone, Jackie. You buried Jenny years ago. I know, I know. Listen, Aunt Sarah, thanks for looking out for me, but I'm okay, all right? Just got a lot on my mind right now is all. Fine. You ever get the balls to actually talk about all this? Come see me in my room. Oh wow, I'm, I'm gonna. What the? F uh, <laughs> okay, I'm gonna talk with the granny right, about my private jobs, stuff. Let's talk. What do you mean, like my father? I loved your father. Everyone loved Carlo. He just had that way about him. But before, before we lost him, he couldn't let things go. 
He became obsessed, and that obsession consumed him, Jackie. I don't want to see the same thing happen to you. Obsessed with what? It, it's not important. Y you just have to let go, Jackie. You have to move on with your life. I am, Aunt Sarah. I am. You really are the worst liar I've ever met. And I grew up with thieves. Huh. So what then? I'm seeing ghosts? I don't believe in ghosts, Jackie. But I do believe in being haunted. You need to man up and let all of this go. Yeah. All right. How come you're always right? Comes with age, kiddo. I'll talk to you later, Aunt Sarah. You know where to find me. Uh, no, but, uh, yeah, okay. Well, goodbye. Uh, <laughs> holy damn. This looks pretty good. Damn. Turn off the tab there. Even ta oh, we can't even go to... Oh, damn. We can probably sit in the toilet. Can we flush out? No. Hmm. That kind of suck. Huh. Don't really know what to do. Maybe sleep. Wait, do we, do we have any... Any stuff we had to do or something? I can't remember the button to... To actually start doing stuff. That kind of sucks. Wait, let me quickly go into the options. Really quickly. Controls. Um, I'm not using a controller. Keyboard controls. There we go. Um, Cause I have to do this. Objectives. Backspace. What the? F what? Backspace to. It doesn't even work. What the heck? Hmm. I don't know. Okay. Well, I think I'll just go outside and maybe go downstairs or something. Turn to Vinny in the uh, atrium. Hey, right. boss. So what's what? I got a job I for you. To go find somebody for me. Johnny Powell lives down by the Queensboro Bridge. You find him and bring him back here. Johnny Powell. Ain't that the guy that used to help you out with that thing of yours? He was a weird fuck. Whatever happened to that guy anyway? It don't matter. I need him back. Go bring him by for a visit. And hey, you don't have to be nice to him. Whatever you say, boss. I'll have the new guys go get him. Oh, hey, uh, Jimmy's waiting for you in your office. He's got a lead on the guys who hit us tonight. Thanks, Finney. Anytime, boss. Let me know if you need anything else. Okay, sweet. So, it's hey, time boss. to go to the office. Huh. Let's see how high hall's office we- Oh, wow. We have so many bathrooms in here. <laughs> Damn, he looks kind of friggy. So, backspace. Like, backspace? What the fuck? That's, that's kind of weird. Daddy. Weird button Good to, see you to use. Alright, so it's Jimmy. You got information for me. This thing at the restaurant. I just heard from Emilio Capizzi. A couple of hours later, someone torched our warehouse down at the docks, and Freddy tells me two of our boys got clipped outside of Gino's Deli tonight. Somebody's making a play. Whoever did this to us is dead. You hear me, Jimmy? There's the Jackie Estacado I know. Vinny told me you got that thing of yours back tonight. It's about fucking time. All right, all right. Just tell me what you know already. A waiter recognized one of the guys who came into the restaurant tonight. Some guy named Swifty. Oh, Swifty. Yeah, I know that prick. He left as soon as I got there. Yeah, I never actually met him before, but I'm definitely looking forward to meeting him now. I had Vinny get some of the boys together. Let us know when you're ready to go and kick some righteous ass. Leave the mansion with Vinny. Oh, yeah. It's time to freaking kick some butt. Um. Alright, am I actually already out of breath? It's kind of crazy. Cause that damn freaking cold is really annoying. What say we go pay this asshole Swifty a visit? Yeah, let's go, man. Let's go crack some skulls. <laughs> crack some boss. skulls. Let's head down. Let's head down. Oh, this is a hotel room or something? It's kind of a freaky. Well, here we go. Huge. Time to go to work. Okay, so what are you waiting for? <laughs> Just standing there. Want to know something funny? When I was a kid. The dark used to scare the shit right out of me. I always felt like there was something out there. In the shadows. Just waiting. 
And Sarah always said I was a smart kid. She tried to tell me, Jackie, either you control your fears or they'll control you. And I tried to control them, believe me. I tried. But every night, there I was, hiding under the sheets, trying to convince myself that whatever was out there wasn't real. Thank God I outgrew that shit, huh? Ah. What do you call those creatures that you have on your neck sometimes? <laughs> hey, Jackie's here. Yo, Jackie. Yeah. Hey, you wanna give me a hand here? No. Bag says I'm not supposed to lift anything heavy. Yeah, well then you should have no problem. 